Today I'm going to be unboxing Genius's GX Gaming Maris X Gaming Mouse. Now I'm not going to pretend to be some kind of expert on gaming peripherals because for the past two to three years I've pretty much just been using a standard cheap mouse from Microsoft. So in reviewing this mouse it will be interesting for me to see whether or not I notice a significant difference between this gaming specific mouse and my old standard mouse from Microsoft. And if I find out I've been missing out this whole time and I've noticed that there is a significant difference between this mouse and my old mouse, at the end of this video, I will take my old mouse and I will smash it with a sledgehammer. Now, most of you are probably skipping ahead to the end of this video right now to see if I do indeed destroy my old mouse. But for those of you who want to find out more about the mouse first, stick around, we'll get it open, we'll take a look at what's inside, and we'll go over some of the features. One cool thing to note about the Maris X is the amount of time that Genius put into the product's packaging. The packaging has a closable display window and on the inside of the door is a rundown of the features that come with the included software. On the back of the box you'll find more features and specifications. As for its specs, the Maris X has six total buttons, it utilizes an optical sensor for movement, and it offers up to 4000 dpi which can be adjusted in 800 dpi increments. Moving to what's inside of the box, underneath the mouse is a package containing the included software, a guidebook, and an extra set of foot pads. The mouse itself is sandwiched between two pieces of plastic and the braided cable is located in the tray below the mouse. The Maurus X has a nice sleek design with GX Gaming Scorpion logo on the back. It can also hold up to 40 macros and although you can't see it here, it has red LED lights as well. After playing around with the Maurus X and getting a good feel for it, I felt that it provided a huge step up in performance from my old cheap Microsoft mouse. Overall, it has a good build quality, a ton of cool features, and enough customization options to meet most gamers' needs. So, in my opinion, if you do have the money, it is worth it to ditch your old standard mouse in favor for a gaming-specific mouse. And, as promised, I will be destroying my old mouse with a sledgehammer at the end of this video. But for now, that wraps up this unboxing and overview of Genius's GX Gaming Maurus X Gaming Mouse. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and be sure to stay tuned for the full in-depth written review of this mouse on EliteGamingComputers.com. Now let's go see how my old mouse stands up against my sledgehammer. 